a group of cardiologists from South Africa, Cape Town, are in the country to conduct cardiac skills transfer to medical personnel in the country. The team, which arrived two days ago, are at the National Heart Hospital, where they are conducting a new procedure called balloon metrovalvuloplasty. This type of procedure deals with cardiac disease known as severe mitral valve stenosis, a heart disease which is prominent in young people, especially pregnant women. This is a procedure we do on uh, patients that have got rheumatic heart disease where one of the heart valves is very narrow, it doesn't open properly. And this unfortunately happens in young people. So what we do is try to make that opening bigger so that they can be better. Stellenbosch University Interventional Cardiologist, Dr. Hill Mithwich, explain more about the procedure. This is a condition that is found in mostly in Africa and in, in developing countries and we in sub-Saharan Africa have one of the highest uh, prevalence rates of rheumatic heart disease in the world um, and yet a lot of people don't have access to it and uh, the alternative would be open heart surgery which is also not always ideal uh, with the follow-up etc and uh, so there's a lot of people with this problem they tend to be younger they're very often women uh, of childbearing age and uh, there's a lot of complications that can be fixed dr magdalene peterson is the cardiology unit manager at stellenbosch university from the nursing side that's what i'm here for is to bring all our people up to standard because at the end of the day our motto in life must be to only give the best to our patients. Like I want to tell them they are in the best hands. Both Dr. Weich and Dr. Larita, they're absolutely in the best hands. The presence of the South African cardiologist at the National Heart Hospital has impressed management here. In uh, doing uh, sonographies for pregnant women. Yeah. So one of the things we're looking at is capacitating them to be also doing echoes. Yeah. Because it's the same guy and since you said that pregnant women also come in with these issues, meaning we can also pick it up much earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Jane Simalumbazanis, Enosaka.